Hi everyone, how's it going? So how was the last YouTube lesson? The voice sounds. If you haven't watched it yet, please watch the previous YouTube video before watching this because you're not going to know what's going on. Okay, so so far we have learned that ka becomes ga, sa becomes za, and ta becomes da. Now we're going to continue with that. Uh, just to let you know, the N sounds, na ni nu ne no, they don't have a voiced version because N sound already is a voiced version. N, N, N. So let's skip that and go to the H sound, ha, hi, hu, he, ho. H is also an unvoiced sound, right? But if you make that a voiced sound, in Japan we think of it as a B sound, b, b, b. So it goes like this. Ba bi bu be bo. Yeah, so just add that little quotation mark kind of thing. And this is also the important part, but ha hi hu he ho is actually a little bit more special than the other ones. This set has another type of sound where it becomes like a P sound. It becomes a P sound if you add not those quotation mark kind of thing, but a circle at the top right. So it sounds like this. Pa, pi, pu, pe, po. Yeah, so just remember that ha, hi, hu, he, ho has basically three versions. The normal version, the B version, and the P version. So actually, we are done with the voice sounds. Only the G sound, ga, gi, ge, go. Z sound, za, ji, zu, ze, zo. D sound, da, ji, zu, de, do. And B sound, ba, bi, bu, be, bo. With the extra ha, bi, bu, be, po, P sound. Those are the extra five different sounds that are in the hiraganas. So please try and memorize those sounds as well. So we are almost done with learning all the hiraganas. Actually, there is a little bit more left. So please bear with me, okay? Thank you very much. Goodbye. See you.